I am uh, here. I'm, uh, I am Garth Snow, and I'm holding a meeting. Follows the collective bargaining agreement. And he told me on the phone that if I if I claim the last two guys on waivers, stay with me. Man. Let me let me get this straight. If I claim the last two guys on waivers, and I just combine their salaries, and I give them each a million dollars if they win the Stanley Cup, it counts. It counts for the cap. Uh, Garth. I have a question, Garth. So what you're saying is you want me to claim, you want us to give you permission to claim Finley and Straight because their cap hit has combined $1 million. Precisely that is what I'm saying. But, you know, we just traded for Hickey, who was on a great... I, I don't, I, I don't, I don't even know who that is. Who claimed him? <laughs> Who claimed him? I didn't do that. No, Garth, you did. No, when did I do that? <laughs> we had this discussion yesterday. Okay. Hickey was on waivers. We were looking at the waiver lineup, and we realized that he was coming from the Kings. And you said you liked Molson. You tr got him from the Kings, and we had this conversation. I never had this conversation with you. <laughs> yeah right okay so what do you want me to do again I'm just saying that if you put Ocposo on the first line if you just put him there listen to me if you put him on the first line I believe in him yeah. I believe in Kyle Ocposo His but Gar doesn't believe in him, know Garth. how to skate you're not listening to me Garth. You're not listening to Even me. With... I could not afford to keep P.A. Parento at three million dollars a year. He's a seventy-point winger, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna promote Kyle. <laughs> Guy, listen. <laughs> yes. Do you have a better idea? Hans Nielsen. But you're not understanding me. I drafted him sixth overall in 2007. I am rebuilding, and he should be playing with Tavares. Kyle of France. God, France is the most underrated fourth line center in the league. What's Put your, him on my second line. What's your response to uh, Nino? I told Nino that we're going to work it out. I'm going to call him up. I'm going to call him up. I don't even know how to call him up yet. I have to figure out how this whole thing works. You know, you call a player up from Bridgeport. I don't really know the rules of the game. But when, when I was thinking over the summer, I thought, I, I really thought that Marty Reisner was a better option. There was nothing else, huh? It's not there. There's nothing else. We, we can't afford to hold training camp. But you're so only paying I can't, the I can't call Nino up if I don't have training camp. The Bacchus only getting seven hundred and fifty thousand. Yeah, we, we're, it's not going to work because we need to we need a bigger cap hit. We need a bigger cap hit. So I traded for Viznovsky because his cap hit was two million more than he was going to get paid. Now let me ask you this, Garth. You promoted so, Kyle Akpos to the first line. Do you know anything about his stats? Negative 38 plus minus. How, your response to this? Um, we have an old building. And. <laughs> what? We have an. Car. We what? have an old building. And I'm trying <laughs> to, I'm trying to tell agents that we have an old building. The ice, it, it just isn't made like it is in other places. So, God damn it. We're just not as good as we would be if we were in a new building. Don't you get it? But you do play in other people's buildings. 
and other teams do come to the island. <laughs> no, you're not understanding me. You're not understanding me. You think the Islanders the building, have the I have, I am GM of a team who plays oh, in the oldest building in the league. It's, it's not like, it's the oldest, and that's it. You, you're gonna, you're gonna do something with that? Cause I can't. I don't know what you want me to do. What do you want me to do about that? I think you should fight someone. Is that what you do, Carl? You know what I was thinking? DP should be coach. And when the boom and the box hits, hits. And when the boom and the box hits, hits. And when the boom and the box hits, hits. And when the boom and the box hits, hits. And when the boom and the box hits, hits. And when the boom and the box hits, hits. And when the boom and the box hits. I move away from the rhythm to see if I'm alive Pray that the writings that you've been deprived Will arrive at your doorstep and be let inside Become a part of your life, dissecting every line So when you mirror your life, is it the clearest of sight?